Hi, this is Royce Davis with Idaho Flybox, and today we are going to tie a just a classic size 14 Royal Wolf. A little something different to all the nymphs we've been tying. And <clears throat> it's one of my favorite summertime high mountain lakes and small stream, small stream flies. Um, the hook that we're going to be using is the just a Umqua size 14U001. The tail is about five or six, you know, five to ten strands of moose. Thread is just the Ultra Thread 70 in red. Tie in the moose for the tail. Tail's about half an inch long. One wrap under the back of it. And then we use ultra wire well, copper and extra small. Tie the copper wire in. Next we use I have five strands of peacock curl. So I tie the peacock curl in and I make just two wraps with the peacock curl. Tie that in. And then I make a little space where I'm going to tie in the red floss. Like so. And I will wrap the red floss around two or three times. So, and tie over the red floss. Then I will wrap two wraps with the peacock curl. So, and I need to trim that little piece of floss that I didn't cut very good. And then I do <clears throat> wrapping the opposite direction, one wrap through the peacock curl, one wrap on the back of the red floss, one wrap down the middle, one wrap in the front of the red floss, and then one wrap through the peacock curl. So. So again, the wire is just to make sure everything stays put, it doesn't fall apart. <clears throat> Next, we use calf tail, and I've already stacked it, so it's nice and even. And again, probably about a little less than a half of an inch on the wing. Tie in the calf tail. And then I'll pull the calf tail back, make, build up some thread in front of the calf tail so it sticks up. Next, split the calf tail in half. So, one wrap through the middle, and then I'll make some wraps around each individual wing. So, wrap the other side. Then I will wrap the far side. 
three or four wraps around those. A couple wraps through the middle. Around them so they stick up nice and straight. Then next we'll use um, some Royal Coachman Brown hackle. Tie that in. And then I'll wrap that forward and I like to make quite a few wraps so it's nice and thick so it floats well. So about four wraps behind the, the wing. And I'll usually make two wraps in front of the wing like so. Tie over the hackle. Then I will whip finish. Use either whip finisher or if I can't find the whip finisher then I just use my fingers. Double that up like so. Trim the thread. Trim the hackle. And there you go. And that is a Royal Wolf, just a classic dry fly pattern. I wanted to change things up and show you how to tie that one. So again, this is Royce Davis with Idaho Fly Box. Happy fishing, and if you like this, subscribe and we'll tie some more. Thank you.